Hi folks, how you doing? Welcome to another video. Before we get into the video, uh, please uh, give me the thumbs up, uh, drop a like. Uh, also, uh, can you please subscribe to the channel? Uh, when you do subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell so you're informed of all the videos as and when I do them. Um, can you have a look in the description box below? Check out my friends' channels, great bunch of people. Um, give, give, give them some support, show them some love. Um, if you want to support me a little bit more, you, you can do through uh, Patreon, which is a dollar a month. Or um, you can purchase some merchandise from my Teespring store. Um, we have hoodies, cups, bags, all sorts of products in all sorts of colours. So go check that out and support me where you can. Um, yeah, it's, I've decided to do uh, a workbench Wednesday. Um, it's been it's been quite a while since I've done one. Um, I started them sort of ages ago when, when I didn't have a unit and then they sort of just petered out. But it is Wednesday and I'm currently building a workbench. So I thought, fuck it, let's do a video of workbench Wednesday. Now, I have already started it. Um, it was in a vlog a little while ago. Michelle had uh, done some world and it was teaching her how to do it. Um, not the greatest world in the world, but not bad for a first attempt. And at the end of the day, it's just a, a shitty old workbench, so it didn't matter too much. But let me show you where we're at and uh, what we're doing. So, here's the bench. Um, this, is, this is where sort of Michelle done a top. Don't know whether you remember from the video. Um, the, the top was the other way, it had like slats on the inside, so we cut that off, spun it round. Um, and it just sort of sat in the corner for, for ages because we've been busy. But I want to try and get it sorted out because, I mean, look at the state of this place. I mean, nothing really has a place. It's just shit everywhere. I mean, a lot of this stuff's where we've pulled it out from here and uh, sort of uh, just so we've got room to, to move it. So basically, the idea is that bench is going to go over the compressor uh, and it's going to be at the same height as that all the way along. And then I'll adjust the shelves on this so then they're roughly the right height. Um, and then we just have more space for more things. So it wasn't quite tall enough. So I've gone through and I've uh, welded on some angle at the bottom just to raise it up. And then I wanted some adjusters as well. So I put these box sections in. There's a thread at the bottom and just a hole just to secure the thread. Just some nice 12 mil thread. Um, so I've gone through and I've cut some feet up. What's the, oh, that's very good. So there's the, uh, the 12 mil. That's going to go in there, I'll weld it all the way around with a nut on it so there's an adjustment as well. And then that's our feet, so that's pretty much what I'm going to be doing today. And then we'll get it in and leveled up. Um, I'm not worried about the top for the minute, I just want it in and out of the way so that I can sort other stuff out. Um, but I've got some 25mm thick MDF that's going to go on top of this. This is not going to be a fabrication bench, it's just going to be a quick bench um, that just goes over that for you know like my bench grinder the vice and, and some other stuff you know just just so it's all out of the way um i probably will weld in some more supports across here um but i need to work out where the mdf comes because i haven't got a full sheet of it i've got loads of smaller sheets so we'll just see where that comes and then i'll weld that in later but for now it's just get these feet in and get it over there and then adjust the shelf this is what i've done just uh clean up the threads at the end so can get them in then I'm just welded on two of the flats to the actual uh, feet and then the same on the threads as well so that we can still get a, a spanner on there and adjust it to our need and then obviously I just buzzed in the hole that I had in the bottom then ground it back so it's nice and flat and I'm actually relatively impressed because pretty pretty straight all I did was just hold them in place they don't have to be straight, they just got to do do the job. You can see I've done, done some of that one, just, just welded around it. So now time to uh, get them fitted to the bench and then get the bench in a hole. So there you go, they're all, uh, they're all in. There's a nice smooth working, no, no issues at all. Let's run the tap, tap down, uh, there's a bit of swarf that we've got in there. I'll just put a little bit of copper grease on it just to smear so that everything runs free and that's what it needs to do. So now it's just a matter of making a little bit more space and uh, getting that in there. There she is, all in her own. Um, I've got it roughly leveled off. I haven't gone too mad with it, I don't really care. Probably won't be here for too long anyway. Um, I've moved my shelves about. Um, I need to move that one up a little bit. Um, I'm just going to store the cups and stuff up there so it doesn't need to be big. Uh, that's actually relatively flush there. Obviously it dips down when nothing's level on this floor. 
But yeah, that's, that's it for now on that. Um, I need to get some wood uh, from the house tomorrow. I'll bring that in and then uh, I'll put the top on it tomorrow. But that's it for uh, for now. Um, but I do have something to show you. Let me take you right back. So this is what I wanted to show you. The uh, foundations have started to be dug for the new unit. So you can see, it's quite big. Should be plenty of space to do all sorts of shit now. And yeah, I'm pretty certain it's gonna be the whole thing, up to the gate, all the way to that corner, to that corner. So, yeah. Be able to get all of the cars in and actually do some work. The only uh, challenge is making sure I can afford it. So, like I said at the top of the video, please help me out where you can with Patreon and Teespring. Um, also, like I said, check out my friends in the descriptions. Like, share on social media, subscribe to the channel. Don't forget to hit the notification bell. And I'll, uh, I'll catch you for the next one. Bye.